today, K47 and Jackson King, they've had a hell of a run so far with their wrestling. Here's uh, thus far in, in the state of Iowa and really anywhere they go, it feels like. Absolutely, these two t tangling up right away. Uh, excuse me, Cannibal Matthews is ringing in that arm. Sybil takeover, Zay on his back now, and again, wrenching back on that arm. Cannibal Matthews slowing this match down, keeping it at his pace. Well, I think you're going to see a lot of the amateur wrestling style come out of uh, Cannonball Matthews in this one, uh, which it's kind of fitting because ZK47 was not a bad amateur wrestler back in his day in high school and beyond. And uh, Just a few I, years ago. Yeah, just, oh my goodness, don't remind me. I feel so old when you say <laughs> these things. But yeah, ZK47, hell of an amateur wrestler. He can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody, it feels like. And uh, Cannonball Matthews, nice go behind there and a waist lock. That is a nice Zay Dragon towards the corner, getting that rope break here. That's one thing we, we noticed in Fort Dodge. You, Badger, and I, and Ace, we all talked about it. Cannonball speed for a guy his size is pretty unfathomable. I mean, it's just, it, it's, I don't know, it's crazy how to describe it, but it is amazing to see what he's able to do at his size and his juncture. And now we see Zay getting in control of this one. I don't know if Cannonball got poked in the eyes or on accident, but it's just a simple collar and elbow tie out there. Oh, nice sh forearm shot by Zay, though. Yeah, enough to lead to that situation. And now an Irish whip. Shaking the ring, the big boy taking it too hard into the turnbuckle there. Oh, caught him up, though. Might be dropping him for that DDT. Oh, he just dropped him. Anticlimactic for the fans here. Even Jackson King is wondering what the heck that yeah, was. Yeah, not anticlimactic for uh, Zay, though. He's going to feel that one, and uh, he's not happy about it either. Ooh, nice catch there. Punches the, the midsection, if you will, by Cannonball Matthews. Mm -hmm. over the top. Ooh, is he thinking Trace Amigos here? Keep it locked Looks in. Like Looks like more. Two out of the three. One Can't more for good there. measure. Oh my God! It, wait a second! <laughs> Four snap suplexes. No me. way! Insanity right here. No way! A lot of strength. Oh, oh they said nope. Nice high knee. Campbell rocked a little bit. Now German. Oh. High on the shoulders and neck area. Campbell Matthews there. One, two. I mean, can we just acknowledge though the gains that ZK Forty Seven's been going through as of oh, late? I mean, I think the gains was pretty obvious right there yeah. with what he just did to uh, Cannonball Matthews. This kid has been in phenomenal shape, and he, he's been able to just transform into this really good and really jacked up singles competitor. You put him with, you know, Jackson King. Oh my God, they, they, those two work so well together. I will give credit where credit is very much due. Well, that's a good point. And it's again something we gotta see say a lot of because again, Zay is a young man. He is not even in his adult strength, if you will. But he's showing off some plenty of strength now, taking it right to Cannibal Matthews. Again, another big swing right into that turnbuckle, shaking the ring as Cannibal hits hard. Now, second time we get to see Cannibal Matthews here in Absolute Pro Wrestling uh, as the boss man, Mr. Prentice. Oh, oh nice side belly to belly slam there. Could be it. I was going to say, what is it that you like about Cannonball that you've been bringing him back? But that kind of just said it right Size, there. Size, strength, and ability. I, I don't think we've seen a guy Cannonball's size do what Cannonball does. Nice big boot there by Zay. Stay Comes from a good camp as well. Jason Jones and his training academy. Niles Plonk has helped him. Miranda Gordy's been in there with him as well. I mean, he, he's got good minds helping him get into the best ring shape possible with the size he's got, with the ability he has. I mean, it's unbelievable. Yeah, casual cover there by Zay results in only a two count. His cannonball definitely had enough energy to, to kick out of that one. Diamond and Violence have a lot of momentum going on for them right now as late in the world of wrestling. This could be another big, big win for Zay and to keep that momentum going for that tag team. Yeah, and I think they need it. I think this is a much needed uh, win tonight if Zay is able to do so because those guys, they want to be tag champs. They want to be in contention for any and all titles. You know, we just saw them last week against Chileo for Madhouse Wrestling, and they came up short in that effort. I think that they are bitter about that loss. 
it motivates them. They don't just sit there and wallop. They don't just sit there and cry and complain about it. They try and say, okay, how do we get back in contention? How do we get back on track? And tonight is a good way for Zay and Jackson King to both get back on track, even in a singles matchup. Well, and that's a great point because we did see Diamonds of Violence fall just short of reaching into that uh, triple threat ladder match for the uh, inaugural Absolute Pro Wrestling. Oh, oh drops kick there nice. by Zay. Again, these guys are a hot tag team. They know that they deserve opportunities wherever they go. And I know, again, like you said, this could definitely set them on the right path, right back to uh, in contention for those tag team titles. Yeah, and I, for a minute there, I thought that Jack Skeen might take uh, advantage of that situation. I, I am impressed that he didn't. I, I have a little bit of respect for him on that. But, ooh, look at this. Nice job. Didn't want to get the high knee again. Ooh. We saw that high knee earlier and almost caught Cannonball Matthews off guard. Yes. Both men out in the middle of the ring. Count starts. I think Jackson might have heard you when you mentioned that you, you thought he was going to take advantage there. He gave you a dirty look there, Mr. Prentice. Yeah, I, he's always listening. Always watching me. Always watching. Already had a four count from Joey Jojo here. How about Joey Jojo? Iron Man tonight. All the matches, all on him. He's got a lot of responsibility. It's a lot of pressure for that young man. You would think it'd maybe give him some fans, but. No, not at all. Never. This is, I always say, Waterloo is not his forte. Was he even loved in the Forte Center, though? Ha <laughs> ha. Let's call back to everybody. Ha <laughs> ha. Back and forth they go, Zay and Cannibal Matthews. Th trading elbows, trading, trading those nice forearm shot shots. there. Wow. Oh! Oh, shit. <laughs> Zay saying, let's sling, cowboy. Again, this is Zay. Oh! oh, oh him, you know. Fake the left, hit him with the right. Nice Big elbow. elbow. Cannibal Matthews showing exactly what he's all about. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at that. Gut wrench suplex. Nice takedown there by Cannibal Matthews. Taking uh -oh. down the straps. But well, the straps the are down one. and the big boy's ready to play. It's business time. Here we go up on the shoulder. Oh, thought about an angle slam. Stay able to get away real quick. Oh. Nice Eats back elbow, elbow. Though, out, of the, out of the corner. Excuse me. Uh -oh. oh, he caught him though. Oh, look at this, Jackson hey, wait a King. Second, wait a second, Jackson wait a second. King, what is he doing? Well, and Zay with a great distraction there. Wait a second. Oh, catches him. Full Nelson oh! slam. Oh! Big man goes down. Zay with the cover. That's it. Wow. Strength, wow, indeed. Strength on display from Zay K47. That's not an easy feat right there. The Full Nelson slam on a big boy like Cannonball Matthews. You know, I think uh, Cannonball's tank was just going down a little bit. You could see it there at the end. I think he knew he had to do something and something quick. He had things going his way for just a millisecond. Zay almost made a big slip up there, but it counts to have friends in low places. Jackson King ends up helping him get the victory.